Hey, this is Presh Tullwalker, and you're watching Mind Your Decisions. Here's a fun puzzle I received by email. ABC is equal to A factorial plus B factorial plus C factorial. None of the digits is equal to zero, and you need to solve for the three-digit number ABC. While you mull on this problem, let's go to the You Feature Me, I Feature You segment, where I thank people who have shared my videos. Pop Sugar had an article, this math brain teaser is way harder than it looks. Can you figure it out? Do check out that article and also check out my video. So returning to this puzzle, can you figure out ABC? Give it a try and when you're ready, keep watching the video for a solution. So how can we solve this problem? We'll get started by listing out the factorial of each number starting at one. By the time we get to seven factorial, there's something to notice. Since seven factorial is a four digit number, 5,040, and we need a three digit number, ABC, that means we cannot have seven as a digit. It's too large. Similarly, we cannot have eight or nine as digits because eight factorial and nine factorial are even larger values. Now consider, could six be a digit? Well, if six was a digit, then the resulting number would be larger than six factorial, which equals 720. But then we would need a to be equal to seven, eight, or nine, which is not possible because we just excluded those digits. Thus, we cannot have six as a digit either. So at this point, we've concluded we cannot have six, seven, eight, or nine as digits. Now consider four factorial. If a, b, and c only had digits of four or smaller, then the largest sum we could produce is four factorial plus four factorial plus four factorial, which equals 72. But this is too small. We need a three-digit number. So in order to form a three-digit number, we must have at least one digit be equal to five. So we'll add that to our findings. At least one digit must be equal to five. Now consider five factorial, which equals 120. We can check that 555 is not a valid solution. So that means we can have at most two digits equal to five. With two digits equal to five, we can then check the possible sums and see that none of these produce possible solutions. If we have two digits of five and we check the other digit of one, two, three, or four, we don't produce a three digit number that involves two fives. So we conclude exactly one digit is equal to five. Now, what can we do from here? The largest sum we can produce is five factorial plus four factorial plus four factorial, which equals 168. This means the digit A has to be equal to one. So we're almost there. We have two possible cases to consider. We could have the number being one five B or it could be one B five. We can check each of these cases because B can either be one, two, three, or four. In the 15B case, we see that none of these are of the form 15B. But these exact sums could be of the form 1B5. And in fact, the very last equation, 1 factorial plus 4 factorial plus 5 factorial, produces the result of 145. And this exactly works. So there you go. ABC is equal to A factorial plus B factorial plus C factorial. We get the result. 145 is equal to 1 factorial plus 4 factorial plus 5 factorial. And this is the only solution. Did you figure it out? Thanks for watching this video. These math videos, which can be watched for free, inspire and build confidence for people around the world. And they already have over a hundred million views. With your help, we can share the beauty of mathematics and make the world a better place for you and for me and the entire human race. Please subscribe for free to get the newest videos, watch and share all of Mind Your Decisions videos, 
You can email me a puzzle or math topic at presh at mindyourdecisions.com. And if you so choose, you can check out my books, which are listed in the video description, and you can support me on Patreon to earn exclusive rewards. Thanks for watching, and thanks for your support.